lads. Before this video kicks off, lads, I just want to say the Lockwood hoodies are back on the website now, back for Christmas. Uh, a lot of you have already pre-ordered them uh, and sent me the money, so they'll be sent out straight away. Uh, that the people who have messaged me over Snapchat and emailed me except through the website because I always like to prioritise people who are eager. Uh, but I've ordered a quite a big batch for Christmas, so they are. By the time you see the video, they will be on live now. They might have all gone, so I will put this on Snapchat first as soon as they're live. So I'm not 100% sure, but. Go and have a look, uh, there might be still some left, and if you've not got me on Snapchat, add me on Snapchat because I do all my updates first on there. Enjoy the video, lads. Cha-ching, cha-chung, bada-bing, bada-bum. Good morning, boys. Because there's three cars that get an hour drive, I have to park as close as I can to the motor room and then literally climb across to the driver's seat. As again. Good job on fucking flexible, isn't it, lads? He says, yeah. <laughs> Right then, right then, right then. So lads, we do have a day off work and we're getting some shit done. First of all, my tracking has been out for about a month. I mean, it's been badly out for about a month. It's been out since I bought the car. So we're gonna get the tracking done finally. Oh my God, I've been waiting. I've not even done the tracking since I changed my springs about a month and a half ago. Literally no joke, like it needs to be done. So we're getting that done. I've got a buttering job later and <laughs> I need to get some flip flops. <laughs> Because I left my flip flops at a job months ago, but I always like lose them. Uh, so for the past like couple months, I've just been wearing my bare feet because it's been like in like apartments in Liverpool, so it doesn't really make much of a difference. But tonight I've got a buttering job in Blackpool and it's at like a really posh hotel. So I need to like be looking good. So I need to go and get some flip flops. I have no idea where the fuck sells flip flops in the middle of the December, but we're gonna have to find some lads. And I really need to find some. So I need to do some other stuff as well. So you're coming along with me for the day lads enjoy a bit more of vloggy video but it's always got cars in but please enjoy i don't know why the doors are shut hopefully they're just cold and they're not actually shut but let's go to reception and see all right he said he said they can only do it at 12 so and it was like you're gonna leave your keys here for an hour nah <laughs> Man, man don't have an hour spare. Man don't have a minute spare, lads. You know who I am? Do you know who I am? I'm not joking. No, but, well, I don't actually have a minute spare. But uh, we're going to come back in about an hour because there's a George over there and some and there's a uh, there's like a shopping bit. So we're going to go and get some flippy floppies because <laughs> we need some, boys. Now, I don't know if they're going to be able to do this tracking properly because, I mean, my car's so low at the front, but I, hopefully they will. Sorry, seatbelt. Hopefully they'll be all right with it. Hopefully they'll, they'll enjoy working on the Maya because it's very, very often you get to work on R26, lads, so you better appreciate it, boys. You're welcome. Nah, not them, not blue. Yeah, lads, I think I'm gonna have to go to some sort of actual sports shop because I ain't wearing them Umbro blue ones. Nah, lad, nah, lad. I need some black plain ones. Well, there's a sports direct over there. And there's a JD, well that's boots, but yeah, there's a JD. Sports are right over there, so let's hopefully they've got some. Fucking quid. Jesus Christ. Definitely trying somewhere else. Trying Matalan or something. Fucking hell, that's put me in a bad mood. I can't believe it. I just spent £16 on a pair of bloody flip-flops for work. Jesus Christ, that's expensive that. In December, how can they charge that much in December? Jesus! Not one shop on the whole retail part sold flip-flops. That I, I don't understand that because you go on holiday all year round, you know what I mean? I don't understand why everyone just completely stopped selling them. Yeah, it's fucking December, but it's not fucking December in every other place in the world. Well, it is, but it's not the weather like December in any other place in the world. If you go to Australia, it's fucking, it's, it's their summer. So how are the places not selling flip-flops? Everyone goes to Australia in the, oh, Jesus. 16 quid on fucking flip-flops. Jesus. I'll probably just order some on eBay and return them because that's a joke though. Very right, lads, I've run out of data, so uh, I'm gonna go and, I'm gonna go and get a Costa, have a hot chocolate, uh, and then wait for 12 o'clock because that's when my tracking's getting done. Don't know why I'm going Costa because they have your fucking pants down on the prices as well, but it's better than going to sit in Mackey's, isn't it? <laughs> Not happy lads, I would have recorded in there but it was rather packed. I literally only went in there for the Wi-Fi. So I got to the desk and I said, hello, 
do you have Wi-Fi? She said, yes. And I was like, well, I don't really like it in here, but you know what, I'll get a hot chocolate because I need to use a Wi-Fi. So I buy a big fuck off hot chocolate with the marshmallows and everything. I get to my fucking table. And it don't work. The Wi-Fi doesn't work. So I sat there looking at the stars, drinking this overpriced fuck off hot chocolate and I just did not accomplish what I wanted to accomplish. So yeah, great. What a waste of time and a waste of money. Right, so it's done, lads. Uh, a little bit annoyed because the guy took it out on a 20 minute test, uh, road test, and I come back in and literally half my fuel's gone. So that's a little bit annoying, but whatever. But I did get it really cheap. It's supposed to be 50 quid and I got it for 17.50. So I can't really explain for that. Well, explain, can't really complain for that, but let's go and give it a drive, see if it feels better. Lads, I'm actually driving straight without, turn, without having to go whoop, 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 without kicking off the side of the road. It actually feels even on each side now, like my left doesn't feel really heavy, my right side doesn't feel really light, so it just goes me. But no, it's all right. I mean, it's not 100% perfect, but you know, it, I can't. you can't really get it 100% perfect when you lower your car this much anyway, so whatever. But it's pretty much perfect, so that's fine. It's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna feel so much when I'm driving faster, it's gonna just feel like a completely different car. Or oh, it does like, look like, I'm still going straight, I'm still going straight. Onto a slip road here, lads. Let's give her a little bit. Let's give her a tickle. Let's give her a bit of a tickle. Steering feels so much better around the corner now as well. There's cars in front of us, so we can't tickle her that much. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, I love this car. Feels so much better with the steering wheel, man. You actually feel like you're in a race car and not just like some dickhead trying to be fast. You actually feel like you are in a fast car. <laughs> oh, the steering wheel's so good. All right, we're back home. I'm gonna nip in, check my phone because my Wi-Fi's been off for about three hours, so I'm gonna close the notifications. Uh, and then we're gonna fix the blow on that exhaust. It's getting worse and worse and worse. It's horrible, it's like when I go past a wall. And I've just realised I've actually got car ramps. Now, I won't be able to drive up the front of it because it's too low, but I probably might be able to reverse up them. So we're going to see. But let me just check my notifications. All right, let's show you something a bit more uh, a bit more reasonable. Funny story about these shoes, actually, right? See how they're yellow? They're, like, white and yellow, right? These are actually, like, my favourite pair of shoes, and they were, like, really, really, really white. And I thought, well, we'll get a little bit of a dough, put them in the wash. What did I do? Put them in with, with my yellow microfibers and they turn fucking yellow. So now they're the gym shoes and the car shoes. Yes, I know. Okay, the ramps are back there. I can't fit through there. I know I'm skinny, but I'm not that skinny, so I'm gonna have to climb under. Ugh, I don't know how easy this is gonna be. Get up them. To the end of the road. Smashed it. Smashed it, lads. Right, so it's definitely coming from here. You can hear it. So, you can't actually feel it. Oh, you can feel it from, the, from this side here. Really bad. Right, there's a guy who walks past every day, right? And his fucking dog runs at me. Yeah, I got that, 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 that. And it scares the fuck out of me. And he, and he just laughs. Isn't that funny? Don't have your fucking dog doing that. Have you got a dog? Don't fucking like yap at people and Like I love animals so much, but I hate people who don't know how to treat them or train them or... Ugh. Scares me to death, I didn't have an heart attack then. 
wanker. So for fucking ages, lads, uh, I've always, I've, I have been putting exhaust paste in and tightening it down and stuff and trying to do it the proper way, but it's just not been working, it just keeps blowing. So I've bought some flexi wrap. We're gonna wrap that round because it's it, it's literally in the tiniest bit blow and it's not affecting any floor or anything. So we're gonna wrap that round, tighten it down and tighten the clamp over it. Uh, I'm not sure if we need this clamp in there. I might just pull that off because I'm just gonna wrap that round and then use the clamp I've already got. Uh, because it's not it's on it's on a joint, so I don't I think I'm gonna try and pull that off that little uh, the little uh tighten that comes in there. I'm probably gonna pull that off to be honest. Loosen the club, I'll pull it off, and we're gonna get that wrap, wrap it around there and then tighten the clamp over the top of it, and that should be good. Okay, so I'll wrap that over, tighten the clamp down. I'm not sure if it's far enough over, uh, but I'm just gonna just turn the engine on and see if it's still blowing from there and just have a look. If not, I'm gonna take it off and then Tighten it down again. Miles better. Definitely miles better. Still hear it a tiny bit from this side. But I'm gonna put some exhaust paste in there and just, just leave it all up with exhaust paste and we should be good lads. Literally layered the fuck out of it in exhaust paste as well. So we should be good now lads. Right, right your boy needs to wash his hands quick time. This door, because I'm buttering tonight and I cannot have dirty fingers. Look what we've got! <laughs> My gun friends round Golden. Oh, they're beautiful. It's what like, it's what like a spaceship. Yeah. Oh. It's a fiesta, 